Hello everyone. I would like to introduce you to our exciting project that aims to improve the warehouse industry. With the support of Ingram School of Engineering and with the sponsorship of Dr. Jimenez, we're conducting research on mental fatigue and cognitive performance. Our goal is to increase productivity and efficiency in the workplace. We are using the Emotive ebook, a cutting edge EEG device to get, collect brainwave data on basic and complex repetitive activities. Our aim is to understand the correlation between, between EEG data and cognitive factors that affect brainwave patterns. We're processing this data using the software MATLAB to identify patterns and create statistical models that help us understand the impact of mental fatigue on cognitive performance. We're using different brain waves ratios to determine the, the occurrence of mental fatigue. This is the Emotive Epoch 14 channel wireless EEG headset. With this, we can collect EEG brainwave data. The first step in the setup process is to soak the felt tips in the saline solution. Then, once the felt tips are soaked, to put them into each node. The last step is to put on the headset and ensure that every node is in the correct position. Once we get the headset set up, we can begin to collect data using the Emotive Pro software that connects to the device. In this example, we gave the subject a Raven's progressive matrices test to put some strain on the brain and observe the brain waves. For our project, we are using a program in MATLAB called EEG Lab. EEG Lab is great for our project as it can take the data from Emotive Pro and turn it into something that can be visualized. Once the EEG Lab program opens, we can import our EEG data and we can clean it up. This is important as the Emotive headset moves around while in use or sometimes just doesn't have a good connection. Uh, the main thing we filter out is lower brain waves. We are primarily focusing on active states of mind. So that's gonna be our alpha, beta, and gamma brain waves. So any frequency under seven Hertz uh, shouldn't be included as those are resting brain waves and most likely mean that the headset's moving around or just not a good connection. Uh, next we pull data in a data scroll to see visually what's going on during our experience. Uh, so we can see if there's any abnormalities such as mental fatigue like we're trying to find. Our plan is to make a statement on the detectability of mental fatigue and when it occurs by performing detailed experiments data collection, processing, and analysis, we plan to help the warehouse industry improve overall efficiency and employee well-being. Join us in this journey as we make a difference in the workplace, one brainwave at a time.